Hey everyone, Trent Gunnell here. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, it's that time. It's opening weekend of gun season, so we're ready to go. Been waiting on it all year. It's still really hot, but it's supposed to cool down by Saturday evening. And uh, I'm unloading everything right now, getting camp broke out. We got to still get a, a lot of stuff done. Got to fill up the feeders and pull out our cook stuff, grill and propane tank, things like that. But like I said, getting everything unpacked. We're looking forward to a good weekend. I don't expect a whole lot of action this weekend. We will see deer, no doubt about it, probably every hunt. But the big bucks right now is too hot, and they're not really, they're not on their feet much, in my opinion. So when it cools off uh, end of the weekend and this coming week, uh, I think by next weekend you'll see some, you'll see the bucks cruising or whatever. So anyway, y'all stick around with us. It's gonna be fun, relaxing. We got all the work done up until this point, so now we just get to kick back and enjoy ourselves. So stay tuned. I hope y'all enjoy the video. Okay, Jared, this is for you. We got the new corn on the left, the old corn on the right. So we use the stuff up on the right first. Yes, that was sir. a ride, brother. <laughs> it's Terrible. rough. Coming Crappy. out of Atlanta is brutal, guys. <laughs> All right, we got to clean up.
We're on JD stand. We never have seen it before on my videos, but I'm gonna zoom in for you. JD sits right up here in that double seater. Right to the right, he's got a salt lick. Then right out in front of him, approximately probably 30, 35 yards, he has his feeder. And then Jerry just has got through setting up this five point on this one. So we got all the feeders filled up now, so we're ready to go. Camp starting to look good. At the cook station. Got all our stuff strode out. We're going to eat good tonight. We're going to have barbecue chicken legs, back strap marinated, some hamburger patties, potatoes and onions, some black eyed peas. Even though it's 80 degrees, you're going to get the traditional fire going for opening day of gun season. We just won't get very close, but maybe it'll run the mosquitoes out of here, the bugs. Can't wait to use this new smoker. It's fairly new anyway. Jared's really got it seasoned good. It's going to make our life easy. We're going to cook some good food on it all season long. JD and Jared preparing the fire. We got plenty of dead brush around here. Fixing to light this thing up and get it going. Maybe we'll douse the... Uh... We'll bring a go devil eventually. You may need a paper towel. There you go. It'll go now. It should be pretty dry. We'll put these pine cones in here too. Seasoned, ain't it? Oh, yeah. yeah. It's nice and seasoned, ain't it? Oh, yeah. It's going to put off some flavor like you wouldn't have. <laughs> That's the way he does it, JD. <laughs> Look at that thing. That's a nice, it's a dicer, it's a slicer. It's just the real deal. Let me show you what these, this is, guys. This Jared brought this thing. It's just like at Johnny's or Wallace Barbecue. Put your tater in there and you jack that thing in the right, baby, and it's all over with. We're going to have some homemade French fries, buddy. <laughs> hey. take a minute but we'll burn all that off and get it good and hot and scrape it down all that grease is getting to town right there gonna burn it off get it ready all right let's give this a try all right there you go normally it's bolted down but you get the idea You dump them in there. You have more room. Looking good. Get another one. I'm not worried about this oil. I'm gonna use half tonight, half tomorrow night. I got more oil. I got another one too in there. Roll 
falling. All right, guys, if y'all notice the temp, I've got it real high. I like a 500 degree, get a good sear on everything. Then we'll let the temperatures down and then we can just cook that meat slow, have it nice and tender. Yeah, yeah that's good. And we're gonna have uh, barbecue chicken legs. We're gonna have backstrap off a couple bucks last year. And we're gonna have some- uh, You can close her down. Close JD, her down. you wanna season it or you wanna season it in a minute? Yep, season it. Go ahead, JD, you can season it. How much of each? Just sprinkle it on there a little bit. A little black nice pepper, pepper, and then we're gonna do a little garlic salt. And then once we flip them, we'll do it on the other side. So JD's done the black pepper now, and we're fixing to hit it with a little garlic salt. Chicken's hard to season, so the more you can do it, it's good, but it'll work out good once we get the sauce on there. Although it's hot, the fire may be able to keep some, uh, some bugs and mosquitoes away. But it's tradition to have a fire on over the day, it's just the way it is. get done with this we're going to get another plate set up the same way i mean you see them we're going to get another plate all right hit them one more little time All right, guys, it's about time to eat. We got some uh, homemade French fried taters, just like you get at the barbecue house. Got some backstrap, barbecue chicken legs, some filled peas, and some hamburgers, too. So we're fixing to get ready to eat. So the Braves are playing tomorrow night at what time? 8.05.
And then Georgia gets to play in Athens at what, 3.30? Anyhow, well, I guess we'll see. Hopefully the, the home team can pull it through. Really? What did he do? He just like when they won, he stormed out there. He went to both Oklahoma games. Game. That's amazing. He went to the Oklahoma game, and they won, and they rushed the field, and then he went to the Texas A&M game, and they beat Alabama, and then he rushed the field. So he's happy two times then. That's amazing being able to go to two different games, though. I mean, that's a what do you do? Fly in a helicopter? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you got to get some fish in the water, and then once this thing rolls, <laughs> we'll roll this thing. I mean, uh, it'll be good. We got a. We got to get the viewers, you know. Everybody crickets now. You a couple of little bozos over here, huh? <laughs> a couple of little bozos. <laughs> Man, Camera went off, but I can't find nothing in the pit. Find him! Find him for us! Find him! Look find for him! him look for him! Look for it. <laughs> Daddy, what about you? Do you got your spy point link to your phone or no? Your daddy, old, old mayor, he's regulating both of them. Yeah, that's all he is. I'm paying the bill. He's like, he's like, they're coming to me. They come through me, and I decide or not whether or not they're going to fly. The time I see him is when I get in the stand. Your daddy's like, hey, dad, has this been here before? Oh, yeah, he's been there for a month. <laughs> What do we got left to do? Load the uh, trailer eventually and then, you know, hack out of here. I mean, we got to clean up the camp. Uh, poop station. Right. All right, everyone. We're uh, breaking camp. We're about getting ready to get out of here. We had a good time. Nobody shot any deer, but we saw a pretty good bit. Ate good. So, uh, thanks a lot for watching. Please like and subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you guys on the next video. Y'all take care.